support to farming, cleaning and disinfection are key components of biosecurity and play a major role in the prevention and management of common poultry diseases. That's why this video was created to outline two critical stages in preparation at which effective disinfection should be carried out using the appropriate equipment and disinfectant before the arrival of new chicks. Before the first stage, disinfection, it is important to make sure that your poultry houses, bands or coops have been cleaned and washed thoroughly and the equipments have all been cleaned and washed using a detergent before disinfection. The first stage of disinfection should be carried out after the bands have dried up. It should not be carried out in wet bands or coops to avoid further dilution of the disinfectant solution, as this may reduce the effectiveness of your disinfection. Also, during washing and cleaning, be sure to use only detergents that are compatible with the disinfectant that will be used after the bands have dried up. Ensure that the disinfectants and detergents that are used are approved by the regulators and also make sure that you follow the manufacturer's recommendation for applying these disinfectants and detergents. During disinfection, make sure all the inlets and all the doors are closed and also ensure that all your poultry equipment including feeders and drinkers are all disinfected. The next stage of disinfection is after you receive your wood shavings and must have spread them within the band or your poultry house. Spreading them before disinfection ensures that a large surface area of your wood shavings comes in contact with the disinfectant. As a result, it improves on the disinfection. The effectiveness of this second disinfection is very very important because it ensures that if your wood shavings carried any disease causing pathogens or insects that could act as vectors to these disease causing pathogens, they are all at this point brought under control. After the first disinfection, shut your poultry doors and allow the poultry houses or bands to rest for at least one week within the two weeks that are recommended for poultry bands to rest after every batch. After this one week period, you can then step in to place your wood shavings, disinfect, and after the second disinfection, allow the band to stay closed for at least 24 hours before you go in. I'd like to say that the second disinfection could also be carried out using a fog or a knapsack sprayer. Whatever equipment you have can be used to perform both operations. But the second one is more effective using a fog, a tractor or the knapsack sprayer. For the first one, a knapsack sprayer or the tractor. 